Hello, Your Honor, and welcome now to Thursday, and thanks for logging in. Sunny nesting and resting today for the Librans. In fact, if you don't get some nest and rest, you might really feel it. In the last 24 hours, the moon crossed over Pluto, asking you to let go of an emotional attachment to self-nurturing that doesn't suit you anymore. You might be emotionally attached to your bottle. You might be emotionally attached to your, a certain family member. You may be emotionally attached to eating when you're depressed. But it is time to let go of what that was, and today that lesson may carry over because you do need to nest, you do need to rest, you need to check in on yourself. This is the cancer vibration. Cancer, I feel like Dr. Uh, Dr. Evil, cancer vibration. And the cancer vibration is the one that checks in on us, like a nurse when you're in the hospital, checks in, checks in. What's your temperature? How are you feeling? Do you need some food? And this is the transit where you should be doing that, or you'll probably be a cranky Libra. It's around the sun. We're in Chapter 3 of Sun in Virgo. Mercury's ruling the day. Today's a real day, to, a good day to get very clear on how to heal yourself. That's what you have been working on all month long. The weeds in your soul garden, the issues that hold you back, the things that sabotage you. And today, with Mercury ruling the day, good day to communicate your needs, maybe to a family member. You know what? I need to do this. I need to go take care of myself. I need a Calgon bath right now whatever that is, or to go find information that will help you heal. By chapter three, you should be now moving into the healing process. And Mercury is direct as of last Monday, so it should be easier to communicate, and it will certainly be easier to be heard. And Jupiter, Jupiter and Uranus have dead conjunct now in Pisces. This is a good thing. This means it's time for Librans to step into a new lifestyle. It's time to step into a new moment. Your moment-to-moment -moment reality needs to change and change now and you're ready to change. You spent seven years working on this, and you may not be actually executing it, but now that Jupiter and Uranus have come together, you're gonna get kind of pushed in the pool. So if you resist, it's not gonna work. And most of the change is how you are right here, so in your body and in your moment. And between now and Christmas, I predict that Librans will be living in a new moment. And it's Thursday, we've got Sadiq Salter's Renegade Aroma Therapist going live today. She's got another plant essence that's vibrating in the Virgo plane. Don't miss Sadiqa, she's chock full of wisdom and she will help you understand Virgo and help you understand plant kingdom and how it can help you. In your case, it will help you in a subconscious level. All right, Libra, that's all I have for today. Tomorrow I'll be back with your Friday dance and Mars is moving into Scorpio. All that and more in 24. Live, love, be. So